fourth name uh, that is revealed even in Isaiah chapter 9 and verse 6 that is everlasting father everlasting father among the many titles uh, that is given to God that is given to Christ himself I think everlasting father or eternal father is going to be uh, one of my favorites you know I love everlasting father he is your father for eternity you know we might be going through loneliness rejection we might be in lockdown we might be sick we might feel sick we might feel unloved you know whatever kind of negative feelings that you have today I want to encourage you you have an everlasting father you have a father for eternity and that father he doesn't change he doesn't change he is your father forever let that you know remember that story of this uh, lost son they say they call they call that parable in Luke chapter 15 as a prodigal son or the lost son I would like to call that parable as the loving father the loving father the father uh, who was waiting for the son to return the father who was waiting for the son to return. So I do not know what kind of uh, trauma that you are going through, what kind of lonely rejection that you are going through, uh, whether you, you, whether you, you, whatever it might be, whether you, have, whatever, whether, whether you have uh, biological parents or not, whether you have earthly parents or not. Today I want to tell you, the father in heaven, your father in heaven. Is a father for you for eternity. He's your everlasting father. And I can tell you very